This is Madeline Frankie. And Griffin Radke. With this week's nightly news. It is Catholic Schools Week and there are lots of fun things going on at Dominican, including activities and spirited dress-up days. Tuesday afternoon, we had the Quiz Bowl with St. Monica's. The winners of the Quiz Bowl were the fifth graders and the seniors. On Wednesday, Dominican had an all-school liturgy and students were asked to dress up. On Thursday, students got to dress up as their favorite teacher or employee of DHS. As you can see, I didn't participate, but my intention was to dress as Mr. Weiler. Oh, very convincing. I dressed up as Madame Ward. Our Catholic Schools Week was concluded by the talent show this afternoon. On Monday, February 6th, the annual blood drive is taking place at Dominican. Please see JoJo Wickland or a student government member for information. If you meet all the requirements to donate, please consider signing up for the, this event. Now, let's go to Andrew Hobbs with the sports update. Thanks, Griffin and Maddie. This is Andrew Hobbs with this week's sport update. Kind of a quiet week in sports. On January 31st, the Knights took on Mesmer at home and won 83-72. The girls played on January 28th against Joan Antita, winning 69-26. On February 1st, they played again against Mesmer, winning 65-25. Back to you. And for your fun fact of the week, a junior, Chris Vance, was born with this hair. This is Madeline Frankie. And Griffin Radke. Reporting, not live, from Dominican High School. Till next week, DHS.